Los Angeles International Airport. At Terminal 1, a group of passengers and crew bound for San Francisco are making their way through security. A short while later, they board Pacific Southwest Airlines Flight 1771. The flight from Los Angeles to San Francisco is one of the most popular routes at Pacific Southwest, also known as PSA. Among the 38 passengers are several PSA employees, including the airline's chief pilot. Captain Greg Lindemood has been flying with PSA for 14 years. The father of three is also a decorated combat veteran. Brakes. Brakes set. Flaps up. Spoilers retract. First Officer James Nunn only joined the airline the previous spring. He's also logged thousands of hours in the cockpit. Thrust levers. Today, they're piloting a British-built BAE-146 commuter jet. With quiet turbofan engines, it's designed for short-haul flights over densely populated areas. Flight to San Francisco will take just over an hour. So do you know what you're getting, boys, for Christmas? <laughs> well, it's going to be Nintendo. And with what it costs, I think they can both share it. <laughs> Anything to drink, guys? I'm fine, thanks. OK, just holler if you change your mind. Flight 1771 is cruising at 22,000 feet above the California countryside. Can you ask him how it's been? Just over halfway through the flight, Captain Lindemood worries about the mild turbulence. Center, TSA 1771. Any reports on the ride ahead? We've had a little continuous light chop. TSA, this is Rocky Mountain Center. It's not too bad. My god, that was a gun. Yeah, the I crew know. now has a much bigger problem on its hands. Squawk 77, Squawk 77, we've had a gun fired on board the aircraft. You want to go to Monterey? Could you make it, sir? Moments later, Flight 1771 falls into a steep dive. Flight 1771 crashes into an isolated hill 170 miles northwest of Los Angeles. It doesn't take long to reach a grim conclusion. No one has survived the crash. <laughs> 